And we begin tonight with new developments on a natural gas explosion in gypsum. That blast leveled a home, has hundreds of people under evacuation orders right now. Investigators have confirmed tonight that this might have been the result of a crew doing some work in that area. And the lingering danger is greater than first thought. Fire officials say a company was digging in the area as part of a fiber optics project. They hit a gas line and a short time later, that nearby home exploded. Investigators then discovered another line may have been cut a few days ago. As a result, the ground is saturated with gas. So crews will go from home to home to test things out. There's approximately about 80 to 890 homes in that phase one area. And they believe that the uh, strike occurred a couple days previous, and then another one was today that the initial call. So it is a pretty big undertaking in order to complete that mission. Investigators still need to search the destroyed home to see if anyone was inside. So far, there are no confirmed deaths or injuries. Our Mountain Newsroom reporter Jamie Leary arrived in Gypsum shortly after the blast. Many agencies have been working this scene for hours, and we know more will be here through the night. This explosion happened around 12:30, and by this video, you can see how large it was. It was taken by a bystander immediately following the explosion. We're told that this was a gas line that caused the home explosion. Students at Red Hill Elementary and Edwards were in school. Around noon, the superintendent said the schools received notice from the sheriff's office. There was maintenance being done on the gas line, and the explosion happened not long after. Around 12:30, some students were even eating lunch, heard and saw that plume, and as a result, they'll have grief counseling at the schools tomorrow. I spoke with some residents who have been allowed to return to their home to get essentials like medication and pets. Other areas of this neighborhood are still unsafe to return to. We know investigators have been going from home to home to see if there are any pockets of gas remaining. We'll continue to follow the story. In Gypsum, Jamie Leary, CBS4 Mountain Newsroom. Now, Comcast has released a statement about the blast, but has not confirmed if it had a crew working in the area. The cable company says our thoughts go out to all the residents impacted.